Look at it. <laughs> <laughs> this is awful. We're, we're grey. The sofa's grey. Yes. Because we're gender neutral. I guess it fits. <laughs> <laughs> to Italish, but no, no, we're not Italish. Sorry, I'm just confused. It's been such a long time, and being back together, it feels like it's Italish again, but it's not. So forget about it. Anyway, so um, what we've got here, apart from a squashed, you can't see. It. I thought you need to show it. It's <laughs> squashed. <laughs> it, it was actually really nice. It was nice. meant to look like this. And yeah. then throughout all of my, like, I don't know if you can see that very well. What? There you oh, go. Okay. There we go. There you go. Okay. This one's squashed. This one is not. Okay, bring it back. <laughs> the cupcake was nice and neat until we were getting everything sorted and I moved things and the blanket squashed it. Well, I didn't squash it, it kind of scraped it. <laughs> But the, the buttercream didn't even go on the blanket. So it's like magic buttercream on a cupcake. But this is our gender reveal. Uh, it's a, an exciting moment. I am excited and I bet all of you are excited as well to find out if it's a boy or a girl. So it's, it's actually not going to be a real reaction to this because we already know what's the gender. But this is just for the entertainment <laughs> yeah. of everybody who does not know what the gender is. Yes. So we can reveal it to you through eating food. The best food possible. <laughs> yeah, which is a cupcake that Coral made for us. Which is actually quite tasty. If you want the recipe called Coral. If you want the recipe, get a recipe book. Oh, that. <laughs> that, that, be, that a recipe works. book will tell you everything. <laughs> yeah, that, that's what Coral does most of the time anyway. Okay, shall so, we just get into it? Yes. What one would you like? The squashed one or the not squashed one? I would like not the squashed one. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I'm gentle. I'm gentle. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is literally what she's been saying every single day. Whatever I say, she's going on like, oh, but I'm pregnant. I can't do that. I can't do that. But then if I say, oh, let's drive and let's park the car closer to the shop so that you don't have to walk. And she's like, oh, but I'm pregnant. I'm not ill. I can walk. You know? <laughs> and I'm like, what the heck? It's just excuses. But, seeing right. someone gentleman, you can it have it. It doesn't really bother me, let's just hope... Oh, there is a bit of fluff on that one. <laughs> we should cheers it. Cheers. Cheers. Bing! Ready? One. Ready to find out? Drum roll. Who's got the drum roll? No, no, no one's going to drum oh. <laughs> Just go for it. What do you think, drum roll? <gasps> That's so sweet! That's so dramatic! Oh, that was really sweet! Bye. It's a boy! It's a boy! Of course, Ricardo is super happy. <laughs> yeah. I am also You're happy. not happy, girl! Whoa, I'm right here! Of course, we're very happy, and Ricardo, especially, like I said before, I am happy. <laughs> it's because Ricardo, on the day that we found out, could not stop smiling, like the biggest smile ever from like the the scan room to the car when we were opening the door and he was there like <laughs> I wasn't just like that and, and I he goes and hyped. I looked at him and he's like why are you laughing at me I was like because you can't stop smiling <laughs> but it wasn't like a like a little smile it was just like it was like a I, I, I was actually giggling <laughs> I was literally I was like <laughs> A boy. I think when I think about like having a boy, I just think you know a little boy, a, a little me. The way I was raised, I want it to be the same. So I think we had a mixture of like 50, 50 pe like percent of people saying girl, 50, like boy. Who, but who really knows? It's all just a guess, really, isn't it? There was actually my cousin that she had a Japanese or Chinese calendar that she was following and apparently it told us there was going to be a boy under certain rules because we did certain things on certain times. Did that sound dodgy, Ricardo? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to say it. But uh, because of certain certain things, the baby was going to be a boy, apparently. And I didn't believe it. Well, I mean, not that it was going to be a boy. I just thought it was a bit of a, a funny app, really. I don't really like apps like that. <laughs> Was that an app? I thought yeah. it was a calendar, just. Oh, calendar. maybe it was a calendar, but it was like an app calendar. I don't know. Anyway, but I don't like things yeah. like that because I don't believe in them. Yeah, but I mean, it was right, but that doesn't mean it was like right because of that. 
but she said it was right because she tried it on many people and worked on oh, every really? single person. Yeah, that's what she said. We're excited to buy like boy things and have a cute little boy. The most thing that I'm really excited about is having him in little jogging bottoms with a little hoodie. <laughs> that's what she was looking so for excited. the whole time, Coral. Yeah, when we were taking, well, we were trying to find um, our first outfit for when uh, we found out he was a boy. And I was like, I just need something with a hoodie <laughs> and jogging bottoms. She's got this image of the hoodie and jogging bottoms for some reason. So it's like little, well, it says cool dude on the outfit. So it's like little cool, <laughs> cool dude. dude. <laughs> so the things that we already have. So funny thing is, we bought a push chair yeah. ages ago before yeah. we'd even known what gender it was. How long, long ago? Did we, like two, three months ago? Yeah, two, three months ago. I think it was just after, a couple of weeks after our first scan, mm -hmm. we bought a push chair. Not knowing what it was going to be, if it's going to yep. be a boy or girl. Nope. What colour did we buy? Blue. An electric blue. An electric bright <laughs> blue. Yeah. Which is really funny because we were thinking, what if it's a girl? And we'd be like, who cares? Okay. This is going to be alright. We like the colour blue, so anyway, yeah. whatever. <laughs> And it turned out to be alright because there's a boy anyway. There's a boy and then we've got electric, electric blue <laughs> chair. I so. think one of the things that I'm mostly looking forward to is to share those bonding times with him. Watch Dragon Ball and Pokemon. When he's older. No. When he's older. No, he's going to watch Dragon Ball from... Yeah, because he's going to know what's happening. Well, obviously, from four, when he's four, he can start watching Dragon Ball. On his fourth birthday, he will start watching the first episode of Dragon Ball. Mm, we'll see. So, <laughs> and then, when he will be around seven, eight, he can start playing Pokemon games. But the old ones, like I started. So Ricardo's got this massive plan. Imagine if it was a girl. <laughs> what would the plan be then? The girl would have been different. The girl would have had... The girl would have had to do the same things the boy. No, she would have still had to live to grow up knowing what Dragon Ball is, watching episodes. So still that applies, no matter what. <gasps> that was another thing actually. I really want to get a cosplay of Goku, kid. Oh yeah, you did say for the little for Halloween boy. or something. No, Halloween there for everyday life. I literally want to take my boy out with the no. with the little Goku no. kid outfit. No, no. Yeah, it's so cool. So that's basically our gender. I hope, well, you know, uh, how can you not be happy, really? Yeah. People who are watching. I hope the people that said I was going to be a girl are not disappointed. Maybe I'll have to come back for a video and do a little name session of boys' names yeah. that we could go with. We'll see, we'll see. And if you have any suggestions that you'd like to pop out, yeah. Just pop them down in the comments below and we'll have a read through and see what are the best yeah, names. We'll give them a little read out, that's what we should do. Yes. We should read them out and see what we feel, how we feel about them. We'll definitely do that. And the names that we like ourselves. We will um, just let you know, first of all, that the names that we enjoy normally are fancy names, like names that are not common. That's mm -hmm. what we like. We don't unique like names, common names. But not unique as in like the modern world unique, like fox and bear. Yeah. Not that, no. not like that. No, no. <laughs> and not crazy names like weird spellings and stuff like that. Yeah. So. But just nice, unique, nice normal and unique. names. <laughs> and we are moving as well. So we've Gosh. been here for like a month, a month, a year. A month. And a month, a year and a couple of months. It'll be about a year and two months by the time that we leave. Yeah. Um, so we are moving to a bigger place because this place is not big enough for us and a baby. I mean, we literally have two rooms in this place, no corridor, just like stairs and two rooms. So we're excited to move. It's going to be a much bigger place and I'm definitely going to get a vlog of me moving, of us moving Although out. Although I won't be there. So but yeah, she I'll won't be, be there. But right. Just guys, stay tuned. I'm really trying to get back on the videos and trying to get all the content that you guys like to watch. So stay tuned and keep commenting on my videos because I always love to, to read the comments. Even though Cora is not in it, she loves to read the comments as well and see what you guys yeah. think about things. This ending has taken us like four minutes. Yes. <laughs> Thanks for watching Ricardo, he's great. And uh, he'll see you again soon. <laughs> All right. And don't forget to subscribe. Just subscribe. And leave us a like. Yeah. And leave us a like. Yeah. We'll see you guys see in the next video. Bye. Bye. Brain freeze. <laughs> I'm just thinking. So I put brain freeze. <laughs>